guys welcome back to my channel so i am painting um this is my mom's kit so i'm painting my this here i think it's called the trave kit she had him before when we moved to our own house but um i'm painting him right now and there's this cute little ear so i'm adding like blushes and different tones to him now to add to the realism i'm i was working on this kit for a while i just haven't shared any updates on the kit and how it's going um, it's really easy to make. It's just really, really cute. See, I don't know if you can see. There's his little ear. Oh my goodness. I love it. Um, so I'm getting back into the whole reboarding thing because I absolutely had such a blast making these. I'm still not done. Obviously, they could take months, years. I'm not sure if you can see anything. Um, I do. You should see my setup here. In the kitchen, I like to be here because it has like the direct sunlight coming in over my shoulder, which I absolutely love because then I can see exactly what I'm doing and how they're going to look when they're out in public. If anyone take, you know, if my mom takes them out, probably not because she goes with me. So we really show. Hold on, guys. Sorry, guys. That was my cat coming down, but it wasn't. She's not even on the step. So I'm um, just adding blush blushing to the ear kind of i what i do for the blushing because i'm fairly new so i don't really know exactly what i'm doing but i kind of just paint the color the blush i have air dry paints because it's easier for me to paint this here is from share air so this is the blush that i use it says blush on there and i kind of just paint it on the ear because obvious reasons and I'm still new, like I said, but I thought I'd come on here and paint and talk to you guys a little bit about um, why I'm getting back into it. Um, I'm getting into painting Reborns again because I feel like it's time. I like painting. Um, it's very calming. So here's his ear. It's not focusing. Of course it's not focusing. Let me see if I pick you up. Nope, if you do this way. Oh, you can't see his ear. Anyway, this is his cute little ear that I'm working on. Um, what the thing I like about air dry paints is that they kind of sit and dry and then you could just move on to something else. Now I'm gonna blush on his nose. What I do is add a little bit of coloring around his nostril area like this, as you can see. See? Um, and then I'm going to use the, I don't know, I'll show you, the cosmetic sponge. Don't mind my sponges. They're a little messed up right now because I've been using it and I kind of dab it because you don't want it to be super, super red, but you also don't want it to be like too pale unless you're making like a vampire baby. Again, I'm sorry about the lighting. Um, I have to sit here because this is the only place that gets like direct sunlight and it's easier for me because everything's convenient so that's what i'm doing today i don't know when you guys will see this but i hope that you guys see this um sometime this week i'm not really sure but i'm just doing oh gosh i'm just doing my thing reborning having a good time and like i said i just pounce on it just just slightly because if you pounce too much it does come off so Sometimes you gotta let it sit there a little bit to get the color. And the, this is air dry, that's why I have the fan on, plus it's hot. So the fan will help it to dry more faster, but I just do my thing with it. I'm not a professional, my babies are not gonna look realistic until I get a little bit better. Um, but, you know, eh, they're gonna be as realistic as I can make them myself. Just trying my hand at things and seeing how it goes. I try and a little bit of everything in case you don't better down here in case you don't realize that by now I'm that's how I am I did go on project after project if you're not following me on my tripod oh, tripod, my um podcast you need to guys you really need to you need to be following me on there oh and I'm gonna be um sharing this whole rewarding process with you guys on my patreon so if you want to follow me on patreon that is the place to follow my reborning skills and stuff 
I try to make it a dollar for support, um, but they said the lowest it had to be three dollars. So three dollars it helps goes towards my videos to make better content. Thinking more reddish by okay, you know, so it helps support me and my channel and you know I don't I'm not asking you guys to go over to Patreon and like go do it, you know. I don't expect anything to come from my Patreon. Like most people have lots of people on Patreon. I have a small following as you can see on my YouTube channel. But that's just me. Maybe one day I'll have a lot of following, but I really don't expect to have much following. Um I don't know why, I just don't. I am not cut out for this, I guess. Uh, you know, I guess I don't know. And I'm just having fun. So I hope you guys are enjoying my funness and watching me sit here and reborn like some some weird person. I guess you can call me. See, look at his little ear. Oh god, it's not really focusing. I wish it would focus a little bit better, but here he is. He needs more coloring on his lips and everything, and here's his other ear. Oh my god, it's so cute. Um, I'm doing a mix of this is called Apple Barrel. And a mix of Share Air's paints as well. So, because the flush wasn't really coming out with the Share Air. I don't know if I was doing something wrong or what. But it wasn't really popping the color that I wanted it to. And really, this is okay, but it's not really something. I mean, it's okay for me, to, for starters, you know, to keep doing my rewarding process. But I wouldn't, like, suggest... It and then you get like a darker color because this here is sun kissed peach. And no, I want to do it like an AA baby, love to do that, but you know, um, not really. So I'm just going to continue to do this and I'll probably show you pictures, progress pictures at the end of this, how he's coming along. So thanks for watching, guys. Love you. Oh, yeah, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, and don't forget to follow me on TikTok and um, Instagram and Facebook. And here, obviously, if you're new, hit the subscribe button. Love you guys. Bye. Okay, guys. Here's what I was working on in the video. I was working on this cute little ear. And he does have veining already, as you can see, in his head. Um, I'm trying to get a better view. In his head and some mottling. It's really not showing up. Um, but here's his other cute little ear. He looks so adorable. I love it. Okay, guys. So that is my... So I was working on him. And I have her as well. He's the blaze kit. And I'm going to make him a boy. I'm going to have to practice rooting hair. But he's going to have like short hair. But look how cute. I mean, he looks like a girl to me. But um, is this blaze? Yeah, this is blaze. So this is going to be a boy. And this is my little setup here. Oh, I forgot my Pepsi. Okay, guys. Bye.